All right, we have a 1970s Corvette here. Uh, a lot of the screw holes that hold this closeout panel on are stripped out. Um, you can just push these screws right in. They don't, they, they're really loose, they don't hold. You can tighten them up and they just won't ever tighten down. So, I'm going to show you how you can fix that so your screws work and you don't have to go to a non-factory oversized bolt. So what you're going to need to do is uh, go ahead and get a dolly and a hammer. This actually works really well. This is a brake block that's made of brass. Uh, usually dollies are steel, but uh, this is uh, kind of a makeshift thing. It works really well. I use this for pounding on things I don't want to mar up and damage them. So, uh, and it's got this little ledge here that's going to work really nice because there's a ledge that runs throughout here. So, I'm going to show you what you do. You basically, all you do is just pop the dolly behind that ledge, make sure it's sitting plus. I can see it through the hole there. And what you got to do is hold it on there. Give it a couple whacks and that hole will actually close back up. See, when they're stripped out, it's not actually taking material out of the bolt hole. It's actually just pulling the sheet metal out. So the screw just gets really loose. And what we're doing is we're actually hammering that sheet metal back down so the screw will have something to bite onto. Um, it's really a common issue with old cars. You know, guys get in there and they pull the bolts down way too damn tight. And uh, that's when you get these issues. So, again, all you got to do is just dolly it up. Give it a couple whacks until it's nice and smooth on the surface and you know you've knocked all those threads back down in there. This feels good. This is a little rough. Fix that one. Nice and smooth. This one's really bad. What do we do with that? Let's see what surface all of you. Line it up so you can see it. pretty much all you have to do. So now, when you want to install this panel, let's grab our screw Now when you go to install this panel, the screws will actually hold it. You can, you can tighten them up. You don't need to be crazy tight with them. But uh, that's pretty much all you got to do. Just give it a shot. Nice and tight. And uh, basically that's what you got to do. It works pretty well. Save your old bolts. And uh, make sure everything's good and solid. That we don't have like this guy had where this panel actually dropped and it bent this whole piece here and it got caught up in the door jam causing him to lose some paint there um, you know missing hardware is never any good so he only had one bolt holding this panel up which was this this one right down here in the corner so every single one of these holes was stripped out pretty bad so i'm going to do that with some of the panels the panel mounting hardware, which is right there, and there's one up in the front here, and uh, this, sh this door should go together fairly tightly and uh, look pretty well, so that's it. Got the other panel off, I'm going to do the same with that side.